from Universal Orlando Resort in sunny Florida. It's time for the Family Feud TNA Wrestling Special. And now, here's the star of our show, Mr. Steve Harvey. Welcome to our TNA Wrestling Special with these wrestlers and the Knockouts. They're going to be battling out for bragging rights and $20,000. Well, let's meet our two teams. Here are, it is the Wrestlers. Yeah! My man. Yeah, how you feeling, man? Good, how are you? Hey, man, let me ask you something. Hi. This is for everybody. If you weren't doing what you do, what, what would you do a living? Do for a living? What, what, what would you I'd really train like elephants at the zoo? Train <laughs> elephant. <laughs> Good answer. Number one answer. Number one answer. Introduce everybody, man. We got the blueprint, Matt Morgan. We've got the legendary, legendary Nick Foley. And the whole freaking show, Rob Bam Bam. Will you do me yeah. a favor? Will you go over there and like just lean in like this and mm, with the ladies? Yeah, yeah, that's what I remember you? as a kid, you know. The... Yeah, I know Richard Dawson. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. See, Richard Dawson didn't have a wife. And, uh, <laughs> Richard Dawson. All that kissing and stuff. Oh, I want to, but you know. <laughs> but I'll get close though. Let's go meet the knockouts. Velvet, how you doing? How are you? Good, good, good. Let's meet everybody. I have here my beautiful tag team partner, Angelina Love, the lovely Lacey, the mysterious Tara, and the adorable fiery redhead, Christy Hemming. Yay! Hey, let's get it on, everybody. Give me Velvet Scott. Give me Mr. Anderson, let's go. Ooh. All right, that's nice, yeah, you do it, Mr. Anderson, hey. yeah. I'm living through you. <laughs> <laughs> Top six answers on the board, here we go. <laughs> Name a part of your body on which you'd hate to get a wart. Velvet. Your face. Your face. <laughs> Pass or play? I don't know who We're gonna play. They're gonna, gonna play. play. Angelina, hi, name a part of your body on which you'd hate to get a wart. My butt. Woo! Her butt. It doesn't have warts, I've seen it. Yeah. All good. <laughs> Changing perverts. <laughs> you no, know, I, I don't even know what her answer is. This is up there. Yeah. Lacey. Name a part of your body in which you'd hate to get a wart. Your genitals. <laughs> I would hate that. <laughs> on, your, on your little GG things. <laughs> Never thought I'd do this, but yeah. <laughs> Tara, what do you think it is? Name a part of your body in which you'd hate to get a wart. My hand. Yeah. Your hand. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. No strikes. Hey, Christy, what do you think it is? My chest. Yeah. That's very distracting. <laughs> your chest. Oh. Only one strike, ladies. Velvet, name a part of your body in which you'd hate to get a wart. My feet. On her feet. Yeah. <laughs> only one answer left. You only got one strike. My mouth. On your <laughs> mouth. <laughs> they cleared it, man. So happy for them. Hey, let's move on to question two. Give me Angelina Love. Give me Matt Morgan. All right, guys, here we go. Top six answers are on the board. Tell me something you might slide down. Angelina. 
a poll. Sliding down the pole. <laughs> One answer can top it, Matt. Slide. He said a slide. Yeah, yeah. Pass or play? They're gonna play. Mick Foley, my man, let's do it. Tell me something you might slide down. A banister. A banister yeah, sliding yeah. down the banister. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Jay? Little kids slide off the bed all the time. How about that? Little kids slide Mixed off the bed all the, the time. <laughs> Sliding off the oh. RVD, my man, tell me something you might slide down. I grew up in the snow, and as kids, we loved to slide down the hill. Yeah, man. Sliding down the hill in the snow. Yeah. Only one strike, fellas. Mr. Anderson, tell me something you might slide down, sir. A uh, rope. Slide down a rope. <laughs> Big Matt, two strikes. If it's there, you're still alive. If not, the knockouts can get ready to steal. Stairs. Slide yes. down the stairs. <laughs> That's how you pull one out. Big Mick, what do you think it is, man? Tell me something you might slide down. Two strikes. If it's there, you clear the board. If not, knockouts get ready to steal. A roof. Slide oh, yeah. down a roof. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Ladies, here's your chance. Tell me something you might slide down. I'm gonna say a shoot. Slide down a shoot. Yeah. A shoot for the steal. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Hey, we gotta go with the knockouts, 98. Wrestlers, 92 to go, 300 points. Don't go away. We'll be right back, everybody. Hey, welcome back to Family Feud's big TNA wrestling special. We got the knockouts with 98. We got the wrestlers with 92. Give me Lacey Vaughn, Eric. Give me Mick Foley. Let's go. <laughs> oh, hey. <laughs> Hey, the point values are double here, guys, so it's gonna be worth a little bit more. Top six answers are on the board. Name something that people get caught in. Lacey. A net. A net. Let me see traffic. Yeah. Traffic. Oh. Pass or play? Oh. They're gonna play. They're gonna play, play. Lacey. Fellas, I gotta tell you, man, statistics say that women overwhelmingly play this game better than men. You guys are really surprising we're, and we're playing very, very well. We're like women. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Jay, what do you think? Name something people get caught in. How about the rain? They get caught in the rain. <laughs> yeah, Jay. <laughs> My man, Rod Van Dam, name something people get caught in. People get caught in conversations. They get caught in conversation. <laughs> Only one strike, fellas, Mr. Anderson. A love triangle. They get <laughs> caught in a love triangle. Yeah. And a fab, baby. Big Mac. A lie. They get caught in a lie. A lie. <laughs> Y'all playing well. Mick Foley, we're down to you again, man. Only one strike. A hug. Oh. <laughs> we I'm, hug. I, I'm drawing a blank, man. I, I'm sensitive. <laughs> I'm <laughs> sensitive. <laughs> Big Matt you know, said, I'm sensitive. you can't be serious. <laughs> <laughs> this is not how the regular family plays it. They always go, good answer, good answer. Big Matt said, you can't be serious. <laughs> People get caught in a hug. <laughs> Well, Jay, two strikes. If it's there, you're still alive. If not, man, the knockouts can get ready to steal. Name something that people get caught in. How about caught in the act? Let's caught in the act. Very clever. Very clever. Caught in the act. <laughs> no, no, elevator. Go for it. No. Yes, go for it. Listen, elevator. Name something snowstorm. that snowstorm. people get caught in. Sure. A snowstorm. Snowstorm. Yeah. 
They get caught in the snowstorm. Let's see, number five. A speed speed track. Track. Number six. TNA Wrestling Special, The Wrestlers, yes. 262, The Knockout 98. Give me Tara, give me Jay Lethal, let's go. <laughs> Top four answers are on the board. Name something you like to be near when riding on an airplane. Tara. Bathroom. The bathroom. <laughs> Jay? I'm gonna say the aisle. The aisle. Yes! Power pass and play. play. They're gonna gonna play. play. (laughs) Ladies, this could decide it right here. We've got three answers left. Christy, name something you'd like to be near when riding on an airplane. The window. Near the window. (laughs) Velvet, name something you'd like to be near when riding on an airplane. I'm gonna say the emergency exit. Over there by the emergency exit. Yep, you want to be right there next to that exit. No telling when a flight attendant wants to open it and get out, so. (laughs) Hey, Angelina. The stewardesses. Be near the stewardesses. Easy accent. The (laughs) stewardesses. I would say. If it's there, you win, Lacey. A hot guy. You'd be next to a hot guy. Yeah. Or a hot person. Or a hot person. This is good. I love hot chocolate, by the way. You like hot chocolate? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I like marshmallows in my hot chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna have a marriage. Uh, I love my wife so dearly. Here we go. We're looking for some a hot thing next to you sitting boiling. Right, oh, we got right, two strikes, Tyra. Right. Two strikes. If it's there, you win. If it's not there, the wrestler's gonna get a chance to steal and win. The front of the plane. The front of the plane. For the win, the front of the plane. Fellas, if it's there, you steal, you win. If it's not there, the knockouts win. Name something you'd like to be close to when you're riding on an airplane. A barf bag. (laughs) You know? the barf bag for the win. <laughs> hey, let's see number four. Fella, fella, Hey, who's going to play fast money? I need two players right now. Hey, when we come back, the ladies are going for twenty thousand dollars right after this. Hey, welcome back to Family Feuds TNA Wrestling Special. The Knockouts won the game, and it's time to play. Yeah. Hey, before we start, here's someone who'd like to wish you luck. Hey guys, it's SoCal Val from TNA Wrestling. We're wishing good luck to everyone in TNA, but I don't know about you guys. I am rooting for the TNA Knockouts. Am I right, ladies? We are rooting for the knockouts. We know you're going to do great, guys. Good luck. Well, Angelina Velvet is off stage. She can't see or hear any of your answers. I'm going to ask you five questions in 20 seconds. You try to give me the most popular answer. If you can't think of something, just say pass. If we have enough time, we'll get back to it. And then if you and Velvet put it together for 200 points, look in that camera, tell everybody what you're going to win. $20,000. Yeah. $20,000. $20,000. You ready? I'm ready. Okay, 20 seconds on the clock, please. The clock will start after I read the first question. Name the very first thing people do after they wake up in the morning. Yawn. Name a type of business that has regular customers. 
A grocery store. Name something you take to bed with you. A uh, stuffed animal. Name a shoe size that's small for a man. Seven. Name something people should do for their dogs at least once a day. Feed them. Let's go, Angelina. Let's see what we got. Okay, I said name the very first thing people do after they wake up in the morning. You said? They yawn, survey said. Wow. I said name a type of business that has regular customers. You said? Grocery store, survey said. Wow. Said name something you take to bed with you. You said? Stuffed animal, survey said. That's good. Uh -huh. I said, name a shoe size for a man with small feet. You said, seven. Survey said, oh, big answer there. I said, name something people should do for their dogs at least once a day. You said, feed them, that's more than necessary. Survey said, wow, wow. That's a big number, that's a big number. Hey, clear the board, bring out Velvet Sky. I got some good news for you. What's up? Your girl Angelina, she just put up 113 points. Yeah! That's a big number. That's All you line. need is 87 points for the win. I'm gonna ask you oh, the boy. same five questions. You cannot duplicate <clears throat> the answers. If you do, you're gonna hear this sound. I'm gonna say try again. <clears throat> you give me another answer, okay? okay? <clears throat> it's gonna be a little tougher this time, so we're gonna give you 25 seconds. You ready? Yep. All right, let's remind everyone of Angelina's answer. 25 seconds on the clock, please. Clock will start after I read the first question. Name the very first thing people do after they wake up in the morning. Brush your teeth. Name a type of business that has regular customers. A restaurant. Name something you take to bed with you. Uh, teddy bear. <laughs> Try again. Uh, sleeping cap. Name a shoe size for a man with small feet. Uh, eight. Name something people should do for their dogs at least once a day. Watch them. Let's go. We got a good shot here. I said, name the very first thing people do after they wake up in the morning. You said? Brush your teeth. Survey said? 14. Oh, That's a good one. Number one answer was go to the bathroom. Oh. I said, name a type of business that has regular customers. You said? Restaurant. Survey said? Number one answer was grocery store. Oh, wow. Okay. wow. Really? Name something you take to bed with you. Uh... You said sleeping cap. <laughs> when I ain't got my cap on, I just will. <laughs> Let me see. Survey said, come on, give us something. No. Number one answer was book or magazine. Uh... And then I said, name a shoe size for a man with small feet. You are 54 points away. You said size eight. Eight was the number one answer. Oh, yeah. Survey says. <laughs> wow. We are 18 points away from $20,000. I said, name something people should do for their dogs at least once a day. You said, wash them. Survey said. The number one answer. Walk. Man, they tried to get it for you. Wow. They wanted to go. Come on out, fellas. Five dollars a point for a total of 910. But we'll see you tomorrow. They'll be right back. TNA Wrestlers and the Knockout right here on Family Feud. I'm Steve Harvey. We'll see you next time, folks.